In this battle, we're going to take a look at how you can set up a bombing run with the gyro bomber. So I'll just fast forward here and I'll pause so you can see what I'm doing. Uh, so now I'm directly above the enemy. I could set up a bombing run by clicking in a direction like so. And then I could drop bombs and there you can see where the bombs are going to fall. I could do that or I could let's see here. The, the, the sort of the issue with doing that is that you can end up you can end up uh, giving attack orders I've found you can end up giving attack orders on enemy units your gyrocopter lands and you are screwed now you can also draw a path for your gyrocopter so I'm going to do that now I'm going to draw let's see here whoops I'm going to draw a path for my gyrocopter through the enemy units as you can see my gyrocopter is now going to follow said path and I can I am free to drop bombs as the gyrocopter runs so I can keep watch on the reticle to see when would be the best time to drop my bombs when there are the most zombies to under and of course in in normal in real time this would be harder to do uh, but th I'm just giving it uh, putting it in slow motion here so you can see so you can see um, how it what it looks like and I found that and then you can of, of course adjust the path if you want to uh, you can do something like this but the thing is, when you adjust it like that, uh, with holding the shift key, I find it to be a lot easier to adjust the path properly than when you are just clicking around. Because one single misclick, your gyrocopter lands, and then it's fucked. So now I can just keep watch. This is in normal speed. I can keep watch of the gyrocopter where it's running. And I can drop bombs. Uh, the thing is, though do the same thing over here you just need to make sure that there isn't an enemy unit at the end of your run because if there is then you're going to attack said unit now 51 kills for all of the gyro bombs I'm going to turn around here and shoot at the zombies a bit the gyrocopter uh, the gyro bomber I mean isn't that impressive really uh, and you can see it's firing at the zombies here now and it hasn't killed anything yet in melee just for the hell of it in melee the gyro the gyro bomber it, it at least looks funny but as you can see the zombies aren't going to have much trouble grinding down the gyro bomber eventually imagine if these were actually good units so uh, that's how you can set up a bombing run the gyro bomber isn't that great of a unit to be honest but mainly fun for for trolling in campaign and Setting up the bombing run allows you to just watch as the game unfolds and then drop the bombs at the highest concentrations of uh, enemy units. Strength and honor.